Hey Ron, so some of you may have seen the uh, Sidekick little uh, banner off to the right side and you're probably wondering what the heck is Sidekick. Well, the main idea is it's a performance enhancing drug for WordPress. Um, the first iteration of Sidekick basically enhances the pages view uh, when you're working with WordPress. Now the standard pages view um, especially if you have like uh, you know a couple pages, I usually set mine really high so I can actually see all the pages here. Um, but the standard view basically looks something like this: a big long list, and it's a little bit unwieldy. Um, you can't really. Uh, it's tough to work with, especially if you're kind of doing modifications on a site uh, day to day or you're um, creating pages and you're uh, working on certain sections of the site. So anyway, what Sidekick does for you is basically adds a few enhancements here. So I'm going to kind of go through that. The first big one is that it will uh, allow you to expand and collapse the different um, uh, levels that uh, you have here. So in this particular case, uh, if you notice, I can expand this sub-level right here and then uh, I can expand its uh, parent level or I'm sorry collapse its parent level as well so I can do that for all the pages boom 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 and now I've got a shorter list which is pretty cool um, additionally you've got the different counts here uh, where you can uh, quickly see that you have it's a parent page and you have uh, sub pages underneath um, additionally, Sidekick also lets you star certain pages. So let's say this week your project, you know, or your task is to work within a certain section and um, work on, you know, certain uh, pages. Well, you can easily, you know, open up a section uh, and and quickly bookmark or uh, star those pages so that you can quickly come back to them. Now, right up here, you'll notice there's uh, the different filters all. Uh, publish draft and now you'll see there's a there's a star filter so as you add stars uh, as you star a page that uh, count number will actually go up so when you click start you're just presented with just the pages that you've starred so you can quickly go back to those pages edit those pages immediately now another feature that uh, I've also added uh, is uh, the modified column right here now Oftentimes, uh, I'm working between uh, a production site and then my own local site, um, or a staging site. So, a production, staging, then I have my local site. And sometimes I want to know, I want to bring everything over from production into my uh, development environment. Um, but other times, I just want to bring in what's been modified. Uh, so, I want to know what the client has modified outside of, um, uh, of staging so I can just bring in those edits. Or for that matter, if I've done you know several edits on uh, on my stage environment, I want to sort you know this list by modified so I know what's the you know five or three uh, most uh, modified files that I've um, just recently worked on, and I can quickly just go into those and you know do uh, some quick copy and pastes over to uh, over to the production side. Now you'll notice once I do that, uh, my entire list gets shown over here. Um, so every so often the uh, view will go from entire list to actually expand and collapse. You can always go to the expand and collapse list when you click the uh, when you click the all uh, button here. Um, and then the final uh, feature uh, that I've added here is this quick find feature. Now. The regular WordPress search is great, but you know I often find that it doesn't find the pages that I'm looking for. You know, sometimes I'm just looking for a certain page, like uh, my blog page, and there I go. I, I can easily find that. And other times, you know, I'm, you know, looking for you know uh, a different page, and I can quickly uh, drill down and uh, narrow that target that search. So. The cool thing is that it, it, this particular um, quick find searches on the title. So if you know the title of the page or you know a portion of the title of the page, you can quickly um, you can quickly look that up by just typing in a bit of text in here, and uh, it'll show you uh, the pages that it finds. 
So anyway, that's what Sidekick is right now. Um, I hope to, as you know, as I use WordPress more and as certain tasks um, are a little unwieldy, I hope to have Sidekick uh, enhance those uh, tasks a little more. Um, one last thing, I guess. Uh, the Sidekick plugin uh, is a per-user basis, and that. Uh, it saves your uh, collapses and stars on a per user basis so as you can tell I'm logged in under my username Demis here and everything I star and collapse is saved under my uh, uh, under my username so you can log in uh, your client can have their own set of uh, starred and collapsed items or they may not ever use the plugin it may just be um, your custom little developer plugin that you just install when you you know need to get things done fast now um, another oh let me show you something else so unfortunately uh, I am not offering a sidekick uh, in the regular WordPress uh, repository however sidekick is still able to have automatic updates so uh, I have that all set up so that uh, it comes off of my own uh, custom server and it will automatically update Sidekick when I release uh, new releases. So you have you don't have to worry about uh, maintaining your Sidekick release um, as you're using Sidekick. Whenever you need a uh, new release and there's a release available, you'll see it pop up and you can easily upgrade and be on your way to using Sidekick.